Meet Nancy van der Strachten. When the 75-year-old was diagnosed with Parkinson's disease, she tried many different treatments to stave off the symptoms. Her doctor recommended she stay active, so she chose the most unlikely of sports, boxing. Uh, I'm now nine years declared Parkinson. Six years I really use much med medicines. And I discovered that's not enough. You have to move, move, move. And box is the ideal to move, move, move. So we go on. Boxing and Parkinson's don't usually have the happiest association. But Nancy practices non-contact boxing, which doesn't involve taking any punches. That means there is no risk of head injury. Originally from Belgium and a talented painter, she has lived in Turkey's Antalya province for 15 years. She says the people at her gym were surprised to see someone of her years taking up the sport. If you are more than 50 years old, they really look at you like this. What are you coming to do here? But they are gentle in, 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 from heart, the Turks, so they let me do. And in the boxing ring, here they accept me completely. She enjoys the surprise on people's faces when she tells them about her hobby. When I say I'm making drawings, people are not really interested. When you say I'm a boxer, huh? <laughs> the reaction is immediately. Physical exercise doesn't cure Parkinson's disease, but can slow the progression of symptoms. That's why Nancy has been practicing her punching at the gym three times a week. Despite people telling her to slow down and not wear herself out, she can't get enough. She says even housework comes easier since she began boxing and recommends that everyone follow her lead. Close your, your ears because everybody says, oh, you should sit down, oh, you are tired, oh, you should eat, eat, eat pastry and uh, be, says, be, have no, no, no voice. Go out to sport and do something that you like. It goes to show that whatever your age, it pays to keep yourself fighting fit. Salisadi, TRT World.